It's time to raise my son. Oh my god! Oh, oh. My name is Amber Plaster and you're watching Artemis and Apollo Gaming and we're going to be playing through a little bit more of Oxenfree today which is, uh, as I like to say, a choose your own adventure kind of role playing game. Um, it's much more of a story than it is a game. It, it feels much more like a movie than it is a game. But, um, but it's kind of spooky and it's somehow beautifully, beautifully made. Um, I'm, I'm having a lot of fun playing it. If you're watching this on YouTube, I am originally filming this on Twitch, so please forgive me if I uh, there's weird cuts or I'm talking to the audience um, a little bit. Hopefully you'll be able to see that on the screen as well, and it will be able to make sense, but I'm glad you're here, and let's launch the game. Alex, are you... All right, are you... Um, to answer your question real quick before I get into the game, um, the it is an, a Blizzard Arena uh, t-shirt. I used to work at the Blizzard Arena in Burbank for the inaugural season of Overwatch League. This was my shirt. <laughs> Back with me now? Man, you've been acting like a... I don't even know how to put it, like a bird just flitting around in circles for 10 minutes. So this was right after her I flashback to, with like, her brother. I would slap you or scream or something. It's been not fun to watch in light of everything. Nona, I, I just saw... I think I just saw my brother Mike. What? How? What? Also, I've noticed that... Let's see, Clarissa, Alex... I don't know about Ren... I don't know about Ren. Jonas. I don't know about Nona and Ren, but so far most of them have had uh, someone really important to them die. Um, and I feel like the ghosts are trying to play on whatever you're grieving. That's my theory so far on this, but I'm not, I'm not super clear if Ren is suffering from losing anyone, or if Nona is. They're here. Is he? Was it like a? I don't, I don't know what to call it. A vision? Alex, come on. What's going on? You can talk to me. Draw me a picture here. What's going on? I want to try and help if I, if I can. I was, it was like those time jumps we're sometimes having, right? This was. It's like we've been having ripples, and this was a wave. I was bumped all the way back to when Michael was still alive. Right now? Mm. Really? You didn't leave. We've been here the whole time, both of us. Well, you more physically than mentally, I guess. But other than that, I really don't know what to tell you. I don't remember being here at all. I, I haven't been here. I, I don't know how else to say it. All right, well, can you just, like, maybe tell me what happened? What'd you see? What was it like? I mean, what happened basically? Clarissa was there too. It wasn't just me. It was a day I can remember, actually, when Michael and I spent a random Saturday on the beach here. It was just unbelievable to see him again. Uh, are you doing okay? Something like that. I don't know if I'd like it. It just. No sucks one is doing that okay. Not, that he's not. Literally, here. no one that's, on this island is doing that's, okay. That's all. Yeah. Let's get to the gate. Get home.
First, we will eat and drink, and then we'll go and see the girls, yes? How, how many of you are there? Yes. You see, she does know. How, how many of you are there? First, we will eat and drink, and then we'll go and see the girls, yes? How, how many yes. of you are there? I forgot this new radio goes. Turn on the Lima India Golf Hotel Tango. Turn on the light. For the ships coming home. For the ships coming home. Turn on the Lima India Golf Hotel Tango. For the ships coming home. Right, we have a ghost situation. Let's take a look at this map. We got six, we got half of the anomalies though here. Woo! Yes, light. Oh, hey, light. why aren't you at the tower? This one got a little antsy. Weird stuff was playing on the radio. That voice said I had a mother's laugh. What does that even mean? Anyways, are we happy? <laughs> what we does happy. that mean? We got a new radio that's supposed to open doors and gates in some magical way. Oh, thank God. I was getting nervous that you would have walked all that way and then not found anything. Seeing as how it was my advice to uh, do the whole thing. Yeah, Clarissa's gone though. Gone? Gone like dead or? No, I guess there was a, what'd you guys call it? Like a time loop thing? She pretty much got transmogrified to someplace else. It's sad that any of those words make any sense to me, but... Yeah, should we maybe look for her, possibly? Even if the boat plan works, we shouldn't leave her here. Listen, if we have the key, which is apparently this radio, then let's just go to the house and see. And if it looks like we can leave that way, then we'll go on a Clarissa hunt. <sighs> All right. I think you're supposed to use the radio to tune into the gate, right, Alex? Yes, sir. So are you going to try the gate thing, or...? If we're still going to go to the house, let's just do it. Try the radio, Alex. Turn on the Lima. Green. Is it a piano? Huh. Maybe I need to walk closer to it. for this game. Like, how do they layer it so that when I toggle the mouse, it, it hits different radio stations? It must have been complicated. Maybe it has something to do with the Morse code. I'm not really sure what I Please did. Have but... a boat. Please have a boat. Please have a Just boat. Just think happy thoughts. Yeah, happy thoughts. <sighs> I heard like a little, like a slight, like, dink, dink, like that. Almost like it, it was like 
doing a code or something, but it was super slight. I don't know if I'd be able to recognize that again with all the static. <laughs> all right, let's go to the Adler Estate. Go poke around where we're not supposed to. At least there's a boat. Although Clarissa's is not here, so it's not like Jesus. Can... That house is huge. Can go. That lady really knew how to live. It's like the Chateau de Adler. How did she get so rich if she was just like a communications person or whatever in the military? I think I said when we got here, her family like owned part of the island or something. I think she just inherited a lot, honestly. I feel like I asked the wrong question for that. I want to go back and ask about I want to talk about the boat. That's okay. Do you see those little pictures of people in the background? Wait, how did they get over there? keys there are no oars and before we go crazy it's not it wasn't with maggie's stuff back at the office like with the radio no we looked through all of her stuff i think we did huh. not look through all what, of her stuff uh, what's plan b if we can't find it um plan b with the keys they they have to be in the house for the movers or her family you know that's as good a guess as any A radio lock. The woman sure did love her antiquated security. I thought maybe I imagined it was locked, but no. Well, you do have the key right there. It's the radio. Just tune it a little. It'll open like the gate. I wonder if there's a set channel that it opens things. That was a little easier to hear. Woo! All right, into the haunted house we go. That is somehow oddly lit up. Finally. Carissa! Oh, God, Carissa! I thought you were like Maggie Adler's dead body or something. How would that make sense? How do you get in here? The door was locked. Do you have, like, a radio? No, I don't have a radio. The kitchen window was open. Kitchen window? Where? In the back, in the kitchen. I don't believe you. These windows don't even, they don't work like that. How would you know you've never been here? Look, Clarissa's here. I just here, wanted to question So her. everyone's here now. We can just, everyone's okay, all right? That's a good yeah, thing. Yeah, let's just find the keys to the boat or a phone or whatever and just find a way home. I promise we can all keep talking and or fighting at school on Monday. Yes. I don't care what she says. Just everyone keep your eye on her. Yeah, I just might climb through the kitchen window again. Who knows? Okay, we get it. Haha, -ha, carry on. Everybody <sighs> find something and hope that it helps. Take a little kitten break. We'll take a little kitten break, even though he's just sleeping. Oh, he's a sleepy boy today. I put a collar on him, not that you can see through his... Through his fur. <laughs> oh! Hi, baby. You need a good boy? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> yeah. You my good boy. Mm-hmm. Mm. Okay. 
He looks hungover. He's just, he's sleeping. You'd be okay, buddy. Well, it's not that I don't trust people who climb through windows. It's that everyone has been acting weird, especially, especially, especially Clarissa. Um, and we can't keep acting like people aren't becoming possessed or scared or irrational. We have to address that. That's why I'm pushing the conversation. Because I don't like how they're like, huh, what do you mean? I was just sitting here waiting for you. Girl, no, you were sitting in an abandoned ghost house and we just came upon you and you were just sitting there? No, you have to, you have to admit how weird that is. You have to. Get out of here. All right, so let's explore this house. Man, she owned enough books. It's mostly math, I think. Ergodic thermodynamics. And religion. Sheesh, okay, there's a lot of- Okay, we get it. She liked the smell of paper. Ew. Fascinating insight. We'll all miss her dear. I'm not talking to you. I'm just talking out loud. Yeah. You can only ever talk out loud. Ugh. Ugh. Even when Clarissa's not here, she is just a real peach. What? What, Jones? How are you doing? How are you doing? I think about as bad as everybody else right now. I feel like I've been run over with a truck with acid wheels, if that makes sense. Yeah, that's pretty much been the slogan of the night. We'll make shirts when we get home. Oh man, another mirror. Wait, have you seen this? It's like a, a star map or a diagram of planets or something. Yeah, why would she need anything like a map of the universe? I mean, it's not like she's bouncing stuff off satellites for a job. Or maybe they were back then, what do I know? Maybe they needed to chart uh, signals through space or something? Yeah, maybe. Oh, it's a, it's a draft of her letter that she left in the office. To whom it should concern. She left notes everywhere, she said. Hidden with secret signals. She was an odd one, I'll give her that. But, you know, cool in a way. Maybe she was up to something, you ever think of that? I mean, she's wrapped up in this thing somehow. Well, maybe, but also things don't have to make sense. Sometimes stuff just happens, and that's the end of it. I wanna, I'm gonna pull the string, I just kinda wanted to do it last. Anything else? Is there any other bubbles? Yeah. Phone! Oh. It's been disconnected. <laughs> Bummer. <gasps> it's gonna ring. I'm honestly surprised that some of the other characters don't try to grab the radio from her and like try to fiddle with it themselves. I feel like that's a naturally human thing to do. Like if you're in a group and someone has the walkie-talkie, usually other people are like, let me see that. <laughs> Oh, that's an attic? Thought it was like a cat's toy or something. Let's do up? it. Yeah, sure. The chest is padlocked. Needs a combination. Mrs. Adler was either paranoid beyond belief or just a very tidy woman. Well, she buried information in sonically camouflaged containers, Jonas. My guess is paranoid. To play a little game. <laughs> yeah, I guess. <laughs> oh, that's it? Nothing else there? Okay. I like that we now have a radio that can open up locks, but I don't like that there's a longer range, so it takes longer to find any signal on the radio. Already get into this basement right now? I don't like Ren when he's not talking. He's creepy. 
There's something in here. Just looks like vacation slides or something. Huh. Ren, you were right. There's like a ledger here. The Adler family does own the island. Never doubt me. And here's the combination for the... There's a, a padlock chest in the attic upstairs. 29, 18, 54. Uh, 18, cool. 18, 54. Whew. I don't think I need to remember it because I think she automatically puts it in. She made a lot of... What should I call these? Slides? They're not videos. Um, silent memories? Film? Find anything useful? Not yet, but you know, the night is young. How are you, um, how are you feeling, like, physically? Everyone kind of looks like they have the flu. What do you care how I'm feeling? Like, seriously, why didn't you let me go with you to Main Street? Did I do something that bad? All right, Ren, honestly, the time has come to let it go. Let I mean, it this go. just can't be let a big deal go. compared to everything else tonight. Then I'm, I, 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 don't, I don't know. I'm just sore about it still, but whatever. I'll chew my resentment down till we're out. Oh, sure hope so. Just trying to make sure you're not possessed. <laughs> Already regret doing it. <laughs> Back up to the attic, I guess. Jonas. <laughs> like, please don't. <laughs> I'm always like, whenever someone stays in a room, I'm afraid they're just going to become possessed, for real. It's a lot of radios and those containers we saw at the town office. Oh, and like a map of the caverns. She's written here, tune into the source. We think that means she couldn't have known about the ghosts, right? Tune into the source. It, it's probably something about the special radios, you know? Huh. I don't think so, but I think that's how you get the Is signals this? through the radios. Ah, the though. boat keys. Got them. Let's oh, blow let's this pop stand. Oh, I just got that. Popsicle stand. It does make sense. I don't get it. <laughs> All right, we got keys for the boat. Where? Jonas found them in a chest upstairs. So say thank you. Thank you. You're welcome. I was just saying it. It's not directed at you or anything. Okay. Wow. Wow. No. Alex. No. Oh, Alex. Come down here, please. We have something we want to show you. <laughs> uh, Clarissa? Where are you? In the family room, dear. Well, an oil marinated, so to speak. <laughs> marinated in oil. <laughs> Can you, can you hear me? You there, girl? No. Ren, come on, we got a boat to catch, buddy. I don't think any of them are gonna wake up, but I'm gonna keep trying. <laughs> I don't know what else to do. Oh, she's in the mirror? Ah, there you are. <laughs> now we imagine you're a bit confused. <laughs> <clears throat> this will be the final part of your training, Alex. All training oh. is supervised by very skilled instructors. Stop. Just stop whatever this is, can't you? Just just fix my friends. Please. Your friends are as fine as they've ever been, okay? There's nothing to bleed over. When you signed up for this, Alexandra, in the caverns, you tuned in to our signal. Oh, so please, I cannot bear your excuses, offspring. What was I meant to know what the hell was gonna happen? Offspring? And yet, without understanding your footing, you still acted. But don't worry. The test is easy. We will speak of something we see in the house. And you will go and find it. See? As simple and good humor as your mother. What if I... What if I don't, huh? What if I just stand here and don't go along with this? Refusal to cooperate will incur grim penalties, I'm afraid, but it's your choice. Now, let's start with a softball. I spy with 
My little eye. Radiation. There is, of course, a time limit here. So. Ten. Nine. Eight. What? Seven. Six. What? Five. Once they caught the fish alive. Four. Is it... Are you talking about the TV? Very good. Well done. The older models have been x-rays. But right now, you'd be wise to think of radiation. in the other sense. Pay attention. What are you even talking about? I spy. With my little eye, a notch. Let's make this a little harder, okay? Eight. Seven. Six. Five. Four. Uh, is it the... the this painting? It looks kind of like a knot. Excellent, excellent, excellent. You're doing so well. It's time for the bonus round, Alex. No! Stay quick. This is one you really want to find. I spy with my little eye a picture of a memory. Be fast now. Five little ducks went out one. The, the picture of, of... I guess it's Maggie Adler and somebody. Is this it? Yes, very, very nice. That's Margaret Adler and her friend Emma. See, you and your school your friend who? are experiencing. Well, this has sort of happened before. Maggie and Anna tried to Anna. sport with us many years ago, and well, only one survived. But in the process, we discovered a way for us to return, so to speak. It just takes a little time and a far-reaching tolerance for the ignorance. <laughs> Wait, what? What happened to Anna? Let's leave it at the poor girl didn't know what she was playing with. It doesn't matter. Do not have eternal recurrence. The waves. It's the waves, we think. And we will use the waves to absorb into your friends so as sunlight blooms into flowers. And we will grow. And we will engulf. Wait, what? What happens to them after you're absorbed? Their form will exist with us inside. It will be a swap, you see, of essences, I guess you could call them. Uh, no. So quickly with Anna, but now we know to wait and soak. Ew. Yeah, to be here on the island. And it will be a great honor, Alex, really, to carry us through this life. And on to the next. You, you had your time. You had your time. Don't take ours just because you had some, some accident. We never had our time. It was ripped from us. We watched the universe's conception fly to its demise over and over and over again. When our vessel dashed on the rocks, we had until dawn, and so are you. We would spend our time wisely, and we thank you for your good service. Well, that could have gone better. Soak is such a disgusting word to use. Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god. I do. I need a seatbelt for my chair. I was not expecting that. <laughs> so it's not actually faster. It's just at the rate that the song creates the, the right tempo. That's interesting. Oh, there's another one downstairs. Friends? No. Tell Michael he should go out on his own. Okay, seriously, who are you? Me first. Uh, it wasn't a dream or a vision or something. You and Clarissa standing in the living room just now, was it? Ah, <sighs> uh, no. But I wish it was a dream. Usually, there's a lot more talking horses. We're in. People get all the answers correct. Trouble. I didn't get the first yeah. one correct. Or did I? God, the TV? that all really just happened. Clarissa and everything. So, I mean, Christ. If Clarissa was whisked away to the cave by nuclear submarine monsters, then. I mean, the plane has to be to retrieve her, right? I'm still going to call them ghosts, if that's okay. A ghost is... Or we could just... leave? 
What? Seriously? We can't just leave? Yeah, I mean, I know she can be like the girl equivalent of bed bugs. Oh, come on. The boat's right there. Remember the old plan? I don't know that we Take have a choice at this point. I think fries? we gotta go. Nobody ever said Alex, that. No. Or whoever will stick with leave. us. We gotta go. Not without all of us. Well, if we're going to the cave. Oh, actually, I forgot. I saw the entrance has been caved in since you guys went inside. All right. I know there are a whole bunch Lovely. of secret communist bomb fear tunnels creepy. dug into this place during the 1950s. And Maggie has loads of film about military stuff in her basement, so... Maybe there's a way back into the cave through one of those, you're thinking? <sighs> Let's take a look. What kind of name is a Fippany Fields anyway? Wait, is it a Fippany? It's a Piffany Field. Oh, that makes more sense. Mm -hmm. All right, there's already something in here. Experiments and findings of experienced phenomena, January 52. Awesome. Oh, man. If this turns out to be just prehistoric home videos, yeah. I'm sure this is just the, uh, opener. You can, okay, we're getting warmer, I think. So, if you look at the, like, lines or whatever, the bomb shelter should lead right into the cave, just like from another angle. According to this, at least. Oh, so it does. But... Won't it be, like, locked or something, right? Yeah, how do we get in? It's just like the cave wall, only steel or whatever bomb shelters are made out of. What are bomb shelters made out of? All right, well, keep going, maybe... Oh, what? She knew about these things? The triangle. Wow, that's crazy. It says that to fix a temporal tear, that's a mouthful, in the cave, we would need to transpose to the other side and tune into the source within itself... Okay, but we're not doing that, right? Good question. Yeah, that's... that's going a little above. Above and beyond. Well, I don't know what to tell you, but strap in, boys and girls, because we might have to, okay? If it's the only thing that will fix us. Yeah, but that's, like, scary. Well, something better work. Or we're boned. Or we're boned. Precisely. Boned, all right. Oh, sorry, this is like... this looks like the end, but from the... from the wrong film thing. No, 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 wait. This is something I actually remember from that stupid radio tour thing because it, like, sounded so weird. It's called the call and response system. It unlocks the bomb shelter. This is showing us how to do it. Oh, See? Hi. It says, when someone sends an emergency signal from the catbird station in the woods and the receiving station confirms it. It's like a connected response thing. Brilliant. Really? It's good enough for me. Alex and me will head through the woods, do the, um, call part. You and Ren can hang by the door to the bomb shelter and open it when it's ready. Wait, wait, I, um, I'm sorry, I kind of zoned out there for a second. What are we doing? Ren and Nona are team, um, Soaring Eagle, and you and I are awesome squad. Uh, I want that one. And we're splitting up to work on some old fangled machinery to open the bomb shelter, to get into the cave, to yada yada yada, really save our go lives. I one of these guys. Can I go with Nona again? <laughs> Both these guys are like... <laughs> Hey, what you said to me earlier, I want to bring it back up. I know we're probably about to die, but I'd like to bring up the fact that you're not paying enough attention to me. And I'm like, can I just hang out with Nona? Because I can't. <laughs> Use the response station to open the bomb shelter at the relay point or the bridge stand. Oh, all right. Yeah, I like Jonas too, but he 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 All right. is mm -mm, he's not the and same anymore. And if anything anymore. goes wrong, please been acting weird. don't tell me. I won't want to know. Well, now I'm gonna run over there and specifically tell you at the first drop of bad news. No. <laughs> I honestly thought we were gonna interact with a lot more at the house. Ooh, that was crazy.